These latest military strikes in Afghanistan and Syria have some here in Wisconsin asking for a clearer strategy from the Trump administration. There are also calls for Congress to have a bigger say in the process. Experts say the United States agenda with Russia is murky at best. Uh, Russia has stepped up its support of the Bashar al-Assad regime in Syria. On top of that, we have the meddling in the U.S. election. With Thursday's dropping of an 11-ton bomb in Afghanistan, some are wondering if it's a sign of more to come. The question now is, should Trump have that authorization or is he free to do whatever he judges to be required at some point. Former U.S. Ambassador Christopher Murray says the Trump administration has access to strong intelligence. There are many experienced people in the military, the intelligence communities, the State Department, who have been looking at these issues for a very long time. But some say Congress should still be a deciding factor. I think it was uh, the right decision. Wisconsin's freshman Republican Congressman Mike Gallagher supporting Trump's strike on Syria. Political science professor emeritus Michael Kraft says lawmakers should still be talking Options. They may want to put some conditions on how far can he go before getting congressional authorization to act, which again, the President Obama said, I need congressional authorization to get involved in Syria. He never got that authorization. As the uncertainty grows. The members of Congress are currently in a two-week recess. Congressman Gallagher has been vocal in his opposition to the break.